Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon and only 16 teams are left in the Europa League. It's Walsall taking on Sevilla. Yeah, thank you Derek, with the visitors being such big favourites in this game, the home side's got nothing to lose. Have a go, stick to your game plan, see if you can put them under pressure. Who knows what's going to happen, really looking forward to this. And the lineup for the home side. A standard 4 4 2, a formation you know well from your playing days, Lee. Yeah, I like this formation, Derek. It's very, very important that when they haven't got the ball, they all stick together. Very solid look about it. When they don't have the ball, very important that they stay close together in midfield. The back four will link across the width of the pitch, but they've got to help the forwards. The two up front need Thank you. width. Enjoy the game. The Sevilla side as follows. Getting the Norden goal is Tomasz Watzlik. Ronnie Lopez starts with Lucas Ocampos in the wide positions. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Connolly. Jones. Slip short passing. And that is how to thwart them. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him? Well, as soon as you start putting the ball in the net, three goals in the last three games, that... The offside flag had to go up, and it did. Yeah, look along the line, look along the line. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Lee, what do you think we might see from him? Well, he's set this competition alight with his goals and his form, hasn't he, Derek? He runs the channels, exploits the space behind defences, but his goals, his goals all over. Can't miss, surely! And he's kept it down, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. He's driven in the corner, punching it clear. It's there for him! Stout defending there, off the line. Dano on the ball. Now Ronnie Lopez. Warrington Dano. Ronnie Lopez. Ozim Hen. And in with a real chance. A wonderful intervention. Connolly. Looks promising this. A bit sloppy in possession. Now Ronnie Lopez. Dano on the ball. This might have potential. He has teammates to play it to. The first goal of the match, and the lead certainly doesn't flatter them. It's taken a while, but the pressure has taken its toll. Well, here's the replay, here's the value of crosses, and when they come in like this, almost teed up on a plate, he swings his boot at it, catches it, absolutely perfect. What a finish. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here.
into the advanced position. Excellent first touch under the circumstances there. Norman. Now can they counter clinically? Jones. It might be. And a goal to increase their advantage to two overall. That little bit of a cushion. Now it's all about keeping the concentration. So 2-0 now. Not what he was intending, bad pass. Wellington Dano. Now Ronnie Lopez. Suchek. Buta with it. I believe there's been a goal in the Real Sociedad game. Alan Mack and slipped through beautifully. Running with the ball confidently. And that was a very fine read. They've regained possession. Ocampos. They've won back possession. Jones. Connolly. Just drifted into the illegal position offside, in the opinion of the officials. The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of two minutes of added time. Johan Jordan. Suchek. Ronnie Lopez. Going well, pulls it back, and the ball is in the net. The crowd have gone crazy, and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Well, 2-1 it is here. That is that for the first half here. First leg of this Europa League round of 16 tie, and the second half has commenced. Suchek. Dano on the ball. Ronnie Lopez. It's with Roman Zobnin. And it's with Tomas Suchek. Johan Jordan. Lucas Ocampos. Oh, a fine block. And a quick reminder, we have FA Cup quarter-final action for you to enjoy here on EA TV. It's Walsall taking on Leicester City. Yeah, you do have to be careful as a play. Can he put it away? Surely! Might still be able to do a bit of damage. He got the touch on the ball. A throw-in now. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Looks promising, this. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Ozimhen. Couldn't keep it. Jones. Connolly. Dangerous looking attack. Suchek. Well, he was in the right place. There's a slide rule pass. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, it's the timing, Derek. The ball through, matched by the run, and it's a lovely finish. Fabulous goal. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we?
No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. I can tell you, a goal has been scored at Old Trafford. Who has scored that goal? Alan McInally. It's a third goal for Manchester United. 63 minutes played, 3-0. Thank you, Alan McInally. Lucas Ocampos gliding through the gears. An important interception. Possession lost, intercepted. It's with Roman Zobnin. It's Torres now. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Top class defending. Receiving news of a goal in the United match, Alan McInally. It's another goal for Manchester United. It's been scored by Kevin Follan. A lovely swerving effort from the edge of the area that tickled the post as it went in. 72 minutes played, 4-0. Many thanks, Alan. It looks promising. Won it back. Only 10 minutes remaining here. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. An authoritative challenge. It's Torres now. Ronnie Lopez looking confident with the ball at his feet. A really top notch piece of defending. Intervention, a good one by Stones. Torres. Buta with it. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Stones attending to his defensive duties. side will carry with them a lead going into the second leg.